Hey everybody, welcome back for our last cooking class of the 2019-2020 school year. Today we are going to make some strawberry gelato. To, so to make strawberry gelato, you're going to need a baking sheet, something to wash your strawberries with, cutting board, knife, a big bowl, some honey or sugar if you, uh, you can use either, yogurt, and two packages of strawberries, some measuring cups, something to stir with, and you're going to need either a food processor or a blender. Okay, so let's get started. I've already got my hair up, my hands are washed, and we are going to first wash our strawberries. So I'm gonna make sure they all get nice and clean. And now we're going to cut them. And once they're cut, I'm just gonna throw them right in the bowl. So first we want to cut off the green parts, so I'm going to hold it in a bridge hold and just cut off the tops. Okay, now I've got all the tops off. I'm gonna to start to cut them into smaller pieces. And I want them to be pretty small, about that size. So on that strawberry, I'm gonna do six cuts. And on a bigger strawberry, I might do more cuts. I might do like eight cuts. Actually, I'm just gonna do six. So on this big one, I'm going to do a bunch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pieces out of that one strawberry. We got all our strawberries cut into little pieces and now we're going to add the honey. So I'm going to do two thirds. So I find the cup that says one slash three cup because I need a thir two thirds. This is one third so I'm just going to fill it up. Okay, so we've got one third. Just put that in the bowl. And 
another third. So that's about another third. And you could put less sugar if you don't want it as sweet. I'm just going to take my spatula and scrape it out of the cup. And we'll mix that around. Okay, so we finished with the honey. Now we're gonna add the orange juice and we need three tablespoons, this is a tablespoon of orange juice. So I'm just going to pour very slowly until it gets full and then dump it in. That's one, two, and three. Okay, and then I'm just going to give it a mix, make sure the honey gets on all the berries and the orange juice gets mixed around. And then we're going to put it on our baking sheet. so they're not on top of each other. Spread them all out like that, nice and flat. Nobody on top of each other. And then we're gonna put it in the freezer for two hours. So we're gonna come back in two hours And then we will blend them. So I will see you in two hours. All right, it's been two hours. Let's check. On our strawberries. And they are frozen. So we can scrape them in. And you can see I have my food processor here. You can put them in a blender. I'm not going to be able to put them all in. My food processor isn't big enough, so I'm only going to put half. And now comes the yogurt. So I'm gonna do a quarter cup, one and four. Scoop it in, it's a little bit more, but that's all right. And I'm just gonna put about half of it in because I still only put half my strawberries in. And got my lid on and it's about to get loud. I'm gonna do this for about three minutes. make sure it's all getting moved around. Push it down a bit and then I'm going to put it back on and turn it back on. Okay, I'm going to try it again. 
around, make sure there's no little bits of strawberry, and you can see it's already starting to look like ice cream. Looking pretty good. About one minute more. some delicious gelato. Mmm, so good. I hope you get to enjoy some gelato or ice cream this summer and we'll be back again in September doing some more cooking. All right guys, see you later.